What's up guys, I'm back. Welcome back to Aero Productions. So for today's video, I am going to be destroying my Yeezys. Before we start the video, let me change into some more appropriate attire. There we go. Alright, now that I'm all dressed up, I have to explain. So Yeezys, they're Kanye West shoes, and I have the Pyro Black Yeezy Boost 350s came out a while ago. So for today's video, I'm going to be bleaching them to get the color out, and I'm dyeing them to make them look sick. So let me give you a basic instruction of how bleach works. Come here, please, sir. So, this will be an instructional video, too. Alright, come here. I'm gonna look at the camera. So I'm gonna pour some of this good stuff in there. It's very dangerous. Keep it away from your kids. You don't wanna get into that stuff. It's nasty. Alright, so that's first off. I'm gonna put a glove on. As I said, it's dangerous. I have to be careful with it. I don't wanna get in bad hand. Alright, so to dip in a little washcloth. Watch what happens to the shirt. Put a little bit on. And see that? Change the color. Takes all the color out and it sucks. I did a little bit before. Here's what happens after a while. It really sucks, bro. It's an old shirt, it doesn't matter. Alright. Next up, I'm gonna do this tennis ball. Same basic thing, dip it in, put it on. You know, it probably won't happen quickly, it'll take a little bit of time. We'll come back to that after a while. And last little instruction is my new AirPods. So I got these yesterday, my new AirPods, so I'm just gonna drop them in. See the AirPods, uh, I'm just gonna drop them in. Wait a couple seconds, uh, take them out until the bubbles are gone. There we go. All right, so now that you know how the bleach works, we're gonna do the Yeezys. So I'm just going to tell you that I bleached them already yesterday, but I was sitting there for like 10 minutes scrubbing at them, and nothing was happening, so I just gave up after like 5 minutes. And then I came out today and I was like, whoa, what happened? So I took the laces off already, but as you can see, they're very green, and it's brown right here, laces, but then it's brown. So I was like, what happens if I do it for day 2? So that's exactly what I'm doing today, I'm doing part 2, hopefully the color comes out. So here we go. So let's start with this one. I'm officially destroying my Yeezys. I just thought that they're, I looked at them, they're kind of old, outdated. But uh, I'll probably wear them if they look sick. So basically put it on, scrub it on. And it's probably gonna take a while, so it'll be a quick time lapse, so here we go. Alright guys, I'm just going to give you a closer look. So I have the bleach here. It's uh, just regular bleach from like Giant or whatever, sponsor me. And then, have a little wipes here. I'm just going to show you a closer look of the Yeezys. So before these were black, 100% authentic. Now they're green, brown, all wacko. So they sort of look okay, but um, they're not too terrible. I took the laces off these, here's what the laces look like. But before this happened, um, they looked like this. And now they look like this. So it's a very big difference. They're green. So they look like Rorks. But anyway, um, I'm going to do it for a little bit more. And then I'll get back to you. Alright guys, so I finished um, bleaching the Yeezys. So they look very different at the moment. There's not much change because it takes a little bit of time for the bleach to set in. But here's what they look like at the moment. So as you can see, I used up all the bleach. I gotta clean up later. But they look darker now because they're wet. But once they dry, they lose a lot of color. Because like I said before, uh, yesterday I did this and I thought nothing happened, so I just gave up completely. And I came back the next day and they look totally different. So tomorrow, they should look amazing. Like totally different, much less color. Uh, hopefully I'm turning them white eventually. It's gonna take like months and months. So now I'm going to dye the Yeezys. This probably won't work because there's not enough, it's not white enough yet, but let's see how it goes. So I just have some basic coloring. So I'm gonna go around. Try not to. Alright, guys, I just finished 
dying the easies. So I promise that after the bleach has dried, they will look 100% better. They will look more insane and just so much sicker. So after the bleach dries, it'll look so much better. But I, unfortunately, I cannot show you the final project because uh, it's gonna take a while, probably like tomorrow afternoon. All right guys, so if you wanna see the final project uh, tomorrow afternoon, probably like uh, three, four o'clock on my Instagram, at the Thunder Machine, I'm going to be posting a picture. So just, uh, if you wanna see the final project, the bleach is all dry, just check it out, Instagram, at the Thunder Machine, at like one or two o'clock. It looks sick right now, the laces look fire tight eye looks pretty intense but after the bleach dries the colors are gonna pop out more so you can see it better my fingers look pretty sick too pretty dope right but the shoes look amazing right now the other one looks like this too but it's over there drying um, it looks pretty sick but if you want to win this 100% authentic custom a1 productions pair of Yeezy boost 350 not really pirate black anymore more like uh, a1 camo uh, just make sure to like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment YZY below to be entered into the giveaway. Again, that's YZY, just like on the Yeezys, and you can be entered into the giveaway. And as always, stay one. Peace! Huh, you thought.